In this video, I have a Samsung A20s phone, which does not go into standby mode. The phone does not turn off the screen by itself, and it does not turn off the screen when I press the power button. The normal behavior of a phone is to turn off the screen when we press the power button. In notifications, we have the following notification. USB connector connected. Now, the notification is different. USB connector disconnected. It constantly changes the state from connected to disconnected and vice versa. We see that there is nothing connected. However, we keep getting the USB connected and disconnected notifications. The screen does not turn off because we are constantly receiving notifications. Remove the SIM card tray. With a heat gun set to 100 degrees Celsius, heat the back cover for 5 minutes. Insert a blade to lift the back cover a little. Then insert a guitar pick. Slide the pick along the edge to take off the back cover. Remove all the screws. Remove the back cover. Remove the four screws that hold the charging board. Disconnect the battery. We should always disconnect the battery to prevent accidents. Remove the cover carefully, there is a cable that passes through this cover. If we are not careful, we could damage the connector of this cable. Disconnect the flex. Disconnect the cable. Remove the charging board. It looks very dirty. So let's clean it with a brush and contact cleaner. Use a small metal hook to scrape the dirt that does not come off so easily with a brush. Brush it again with contact cleaner. We can see the difference. It's clean enough for me. On this other side of the connector, it does not look very dirty, but we are still going to clean it and make it nicer. Scrape with a metal hook. Brush it again with contact cleaner. Now, this looks clean. Reinstall the charging board. Connect the flex. Connect the cable. Place the cover with the speaker. Be careful with the cable. Screw the screws. Connect the battery. Turn on the phone. Check the notifications. The notification message, USB connector, connected or disconnected no longer appears. 
Let's turn off the screen and see if it works. The screen turns off when we press the power button. The problem is fixed, the screen turns off and on correctly when we press the power button. Place the back cover. Screw all the screws. Apply some glue. Place the back cover. If you liked the video, give me a like. If you dislike the video, have a question, or have a suggestion, leave me a comment, I would like to know. Remember to subscribe to my channel, thanks and see you in the next video.